Percents are used in many ways in business. Measuring increases and decreases, comparing results from one year to another, and reporting economic activity and trends are just a few of these applications. The ability of managers to make correct decisions is fundamental to success in business. These decisions require accurate and up-to-date information. Measuring percent changes in business activity is an important source of this information. Percents often describe a situation in more of an informative way than do sources of raw data alone. Rate of change means percent change, therefore the rate is the unknown. Rate of change situations contain an original amount of something, which is either increases or decreases to a new amount. Once again, we use the formula rate equals portion divided by base. In solving these problems, the original amount is always the base. The amount of change is the portion. The unknown, which describes the percent change between the two amounts, is the rate. Here are the steps for determining the rate of increase or decrease. Step 1. Identify the original and the new amounts and find the difference between them. Step 2. Using the rate formula R equals P divided by B, substitute the difference from step 1 for the portion and the original amount for the base. Step 3. Solve the equation for R. Remember, your answer will be in decimal form, which must be converted to a percent. Here's an example of a rate increase or decrease. If a number increases from 60 to 75, what is the rate of increase? Step 1. The original amount is 60, the new amount is 75. The difference is 15. Step 2. Substitute the values into the equation. The portion is the difference between the amounts, 75 minus 60 equals 15, and the base is the original amount, 60. Now we substitute these values into the formula. Step 3. Solve the equation for R. Remember, your answer will be in decimal form, which must be converted to a percent. R equals 15 over 60 equals 0.25, which is 25%, representing the rate of increase.